is up with y'all boys, man? They, man, that was probably loud, but what's up with y'all boys? Coming at y'all with a quick ad video, man. I'm gonna try to make it quick. Got a DMV beat here pulled up for y'all that I have been made. I'm just, you know what I'm saying? Posting coming through. You dig it? Let's get it straight into it. What the? F Let's get straight into it. Huh. All right, first, you know, I always start off expand. Natural hard piano, whatever. That's what I did. Uh, excuse me. That's what I did. I went in. All right, cool. So I went in first, did these four notes. This is what I do. I, like making a DMV type beat, throwing them four notes and just have, you know what I'm saying? Have four notes replaying kind of just like this. Like. Simple, almost like remind you of Chicho for real, right? So I went in. At the, after you got them four notes, after you got your first, literally just click in four notes, then have it kind of change. Like how it go higher here. You know what I'm saying? It's very repetitive, but it's still different, right? Then when you add in them bass notes, which I'm about to cut on, it's way, it's, it's, it adds that emotion and texture. You know, the shit I keep talking about. And you see how these is kind of like offset, like they not just done, like playing right on the line. You know what I'm saying? What, what's that, two and four? It's kind of like offset a bit, kind of making it a little bit different. You dig it? What you could do, probably uh, randomize it. I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Uh, what is it? Option R to randomize, and then I did, I do Command Z to like undo. You, you hear what I'm saying? So that's the piano, right? The four notes and the bass notes. It's pretty simple, bro. It's like almost like some Chicho shit. Then what I got here? I got another piano. Oh, my fault. I'm dumb as hell. I'm not even showing y'all the jump. But this is basically what I got it as. Take it how you want it. It's kind of all over the place. You play it at a lower volume. You'll hear some of it. You know what I'm saying? Add more texture and it's almost like a pad slash counter melody. But it's not, you know what I'm saying? There. It's not there yet. But it's a little something. I did add my favorite lead. Y'all already know how. Matter of fact, I don't even. Nah, this is a whole different lead. Let me show y'all. This might be a flute or something, not even a lead. So even right here, I just copied the. Oh damn, I just copied the notes from right here from the from the keyboard, and you know what I'm saying. Pretty much just went like that. It's a bunch of layering going on. You dig it? And I, I fake copied the uh, the other little edge piano. I fake copied that. You know what I'm saying? It's a whole bunch of layering going on. Just different instruments trying to make something sound. And I think this is a pad for the last one. Pretty simple. Just a pad to have some a bass sound that I can play the whole time for real. So I'm going to play the whole thing for y'all. Oh, here go the bell. I don't think I did nothing too much with the bell. I, I just did the little yeet, yeet bells, the little yeet, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The little yeet bells, little, you know what I'm saying? A little slight shit. I done taught y'all how to do that on the other videos. If y'all wasn't here, I don't know what y'all was doing. So I'm gonna play the whole thing for y'all. But you see that lead right here, this lead and shit like that? It's not gonna play for the whole time. It's only meant for like eight bars. You know what I'm saying? Eight bars on a verse where it's like about to go back into the hook and it's getting real lit on the song. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know how it go. So that's that for real. We gonna start with, fuck it, let's start with the kick. Y'all already know, fill in each eight. You dig it? Uh, my next thing, my first thing I did was probably start off with the snares or even the crash. Zay crash. 
You know what I'm saying? And then I got a. I probably did the snare, so I did the OG snare. I think that's you gotta have this. You gotta have that when you're doing the DMV beats. I done told y'all this. I put, threw in a clap in there, and then I threw in another snare. I love that. But this was my this was my first jump that I did. Right, this is my this is my main jump. Like you see how like even right here or like right here that other snare is filling in that them spaces. Come on, it's filling in them spaces, bro. And then I got the clap just to layer over over you know the normal snare sounds. You see the clap ain't doing too much, but I love doing this with the clap. You know what I'm saying? Or or even this. That clap, clap, that's that Chicho DMV, you know what I'm saying? Type shit for sure. Uh next thing. I got these hi hats. I kind of went crazy with the hi hats, like literally just filling them in. You get what I'm saying? Like right here, just filling them in, adding some top and a couple of those. You get what I'm saying? It's literally not that serious. Like I say in the other videos, hi hats, I kind of got to do a whole different video on that. Like it, it's a lot of explaining, bro. Let me tell y'all something about the hats. This all I did right here. It's not even like I went through and nah, I did what? What's this? Two or three bars of you get what I'm saying? Of hat and just control B. You know what I'm saying? Copy the whole thing through. It's like you don't gotta do too much. Adding these top notes, it, it brings different, you know what I'm saying, texture. I like doing the top rather than the lows for real. Even though I like the lows, like I like this little, you know what I'm saying, three peat I got going on here. That but yeah, and then this part it makes that part of the beat real fast. Like when the jump first drop and then that verse drops, yeah, it's hard. So what I got, I'm gonna play everything I had, and then last but not least, well not the last, but I got the uh, open snare pretty much playing. I'm mean, not open snare, open hat pretty much playing a decent amount of the time. Since I already got the crash, I didn't put it on this first jump. And y'all hear that kick going dumb as hell. Y'all hear that kick going dumb as hell in that last part of that, you know what I'm saying, on that last four bars. But here I, here I go with the uh, 808. I feel like I really, I don't know, it ain't really nothing to explain. Most of what I do explain with these DMV beats is like I got the 808 hit and sometimes on the kick, but then like right here, I, like it's obviously gonna it's obviously gonna start off on the kick every time. Like let's be real. Um, on the three, I put it on the kick. Other than that though, I try to just like right here, I got it filling in right before the kick, or you know what I'm saying. I got it in between the kick. I got the 808 in between the kick. That's what I do with these beats. Y'all see these two don't hit on the kick. You get what I'm saying? This part hits on the kick. This part, but this part don't. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But that's pretty much the beat for y'all boys. I'm going to go ahead and play this out. Play a little couple bars of this. And we out of here, y'all. You know what I mean? There y'all go. There y'all go, bro. Uh, for sure. Let me know what y'all want. I'll try to make this video short. Probably keep it under 10 minutes. You dig it. Uh, but shit, yeah. Y'all boys hit me on Instagram. Y'all boys hit me on, you know what I'm saying? Y'all boys hit me on everything. Let's play the game. Let's collab. Let's do something. You dig it? I'm going to hit y'all boys. We out.